Let's kick it off with some news that we begin telling you about that's actually sad and quite frankly, very unexpected news for some Catholic school kids in our area. After nearly 100 years, a once prominent Catholic school in Cuyahoga Falls announced they'll be closing their doors for good after this school year. Now parents, alumni and parishioners of St. Joseph's Parish Catholic School are voicing their frustrations. Neil Fisher has the details on the closure and the plans a parish has for its school members. After 99 years of welcoming students into St. Joseph's Parish School, the parish announced late Tuesday afternoon that this will be their final year after less than 100 students committed for the next school year. In a memo sent to parents and guardians, Reverend Jared Orndorff, along with the approval of Bishop Malesic, say the parish has been, quote, facing challenges of declining enrollment, significant financial shortfalls, staffing challenges, and the need of major facility repairs. Today, parents voicing their feelings. We have the best teachers and the best staff, and it's just very disappointing, very disheartening that nothing was really done to save it. Ashley Layton is an aftercare employee, a St. Joseph's alum, and parent to two boys in the school. She says parents have tried to jumpstart enrollment and fundraise for the school, but it hasn't been reciprocated by leadership. A lot of parents tried to reach out to the principal, to the priest. You know, they, what they wanted was more activities, more involvement to be allowed in the school to fundraise, but they were shut down. Now, Layton thinking of the teachers who will be without a job in just six weeks, including her kindergarten teacher while attending St. Joseph's. These teachers love this school. They love their community. They love the students, the families. Like some of them have literally given their lives and they've stayed here because of that. And to, I just think that they have been treated so badly. Parents now uncertain what the future holds for their children's education. I just feel like at a complete loss. Like I have no idea what we're gonna do. And we reached out to the school for comment today and even asked the principal to do an interview here on campus. She declined saying all questions were to be directed towards the diocese. The diocese responding today to me saying that they will not comment further on the closure. Jay. Ooh, shocking. So Neil, what are some of the families of folks that you spoke to plan on doing now? There's only a few weeks left before the, uh, the students are out for the summer. So they're unsure right now, obviously, this news coming just yesterday. So they're still kind of uh, going through it in their head. The parish told parents and guardians that there are spots available for St. Joseph students at Immaculate Heart of Mary or Holy Family, both just a short distance away. Jay. All right, Neil Fisher live for us tonight on What's New. Neil, thank you.